Hello YouTube, welcome to the Blog and Girl. I'm your host Doug here with your video blog for October 12th, 2011. We have a, I have a great blog scheduled for you guys tonight. I want to start off by telling you all that ALCS Game 4 in Detroit will be delayed tonight. No game tonight. Um, oh, it's ac it actually just faces a rain delay. It's not actually cancelled yet. I'm going to talk, this is going to be my first preview of the night. I'm going to tell you guys about this game. In the other game to be played tonight, I'm going to give you my top five teams, and then the YouTube video will be over. I'm going to stay on here and talk more about other stuff going on in the sports world. So let's start with this ALCS game four. All right, last night, of course, the Angel or the Tigers tied up this or cut the series to two to one. Tonight we got left-hander Matt Harrison facing the Tigers Rick Porcello. The game league officials are hoping for a 5:15 start time. Um, Fox, though, has announced that the game is probably going to start around 545. Just a little thought there for you guys. This is the third game already that's been affected by rain in this series. Last night, basically pacing the attack for them was Miguel Cabrera, Victor Martinez, and Ryan Rayburn. They all had big shots. Oh, Johnny Peralta had a solo shot. Those are the three guys that mainly paced this offensive attack last night, Miguel Cabrera. Hit an absolute bomb. Just want to say that. Miguel Cabrera hit a bomb. It was ridiculous. I cannot believe how far he hit the ball. I got Detroit in game three. Or game four here tonight. I think Porcello is going to pitch well. I think Harrison could struggle. He struggled some against the Rays. I think he's going to struggle more tonight. Look for the Tigers to win this game. And then the second game of the night will be in St. Louis. As the Brewers take on the Cardinals in game three. This series is tied up at 1-1. There's light rain there, so that's something to think about. Chris Carpenter going up against Giovanni Gallardo. Great, great pitching matchup. It's going to be a fantastic matchup. AccuScore has tight, has the Cardinals as a 55 to 45 favorite. Um, if you had to look for matchups that are going to be interesting, definitely look for Gallardo and Pujols. Pujols. Hits Gallardo very well. Um, that could be a problem for Gallardo. That could be his pitfall. Pujols, of course, had a huge game. Game two really got the Cardinals some life. Got them back into the series. Um, of course, we had... This, these two teams really don't like each other. We had Niger Morgan, Tony Plush, Tony Gumbo, whatever you want to call him, T-Plush, calling Chris Carpenter a phony in September. Niger Morgan, come on, man. Are you kidding me? Niger Morgan has done nothing in his sports career. All right, Niger Morgan, all he does is just talk. I want to see some results. I did see Pujols make him look silly when Pujols ran him into a wall. That was quite humorous. Um, Gallardo in his career is 1-7 against the Cardinals. Not very good, but he's pitched great in the postseason, only allowing two runs. Two runs in 14 innings. He pitched fantastic. It's definitely... I think the Brewers are going to take Game 3, even though it's in St. Louis. I think the Brewers are definitely going to take Game 3. The Brewers do look very solid. I'd be surprised, actually, if the Brewers did not win this game. So, that's what I got tonight. I got the Brewers, and I got the Tigers. Two teams that are really making some noise. Um, Alright, so if anybody has questions, they can Facebook me, text me. Um, hit me up on blog TV on my question section. Hit me up there. You guys can ask me anything. I will answer it. Um, so other stuff. All right. I just wanted to give you my top five teams in the NFL right now. All right. If I'm going five to one, I'm going number five as this is a tough pick. Um, all right. I'm going to start with one action. I'm going to go Packers. Packers and Patriots right now would be my Super Bowl matchup. Then I'm going Detroit Lions, number three. Detroit is solid. I like them. Packers, just just respect, basically. I mean, Packers and Lions have the same record. But the Packers, being the defending Super Bowl champions, they're just getting some respect. All right, I'm going to start recording this video. All right, so I've already talked about my, my picks tonight. I got the Brewers, Tigers. Now I'm talking about my top five teams in the NFL right now. I got the Packers at one. Patriots at two. My number three team 
has got to be the Lions. So Packers, Patriots, Lions, and then I'm going crazy right here. I'm going Bills, and I'm going Saints. Those are my top five teams. The reason I'm putting the Bills over the Saints is just another respect factor. The Bills playing well. They've beaten quality teams. Saints, eh, they haven't really beaten anybody yet. Bills beating quality teams. That's why I'm putting them above. All right, so that's going to end my YouTube video. Thanks for watching YouTube. We'll be back on Friday with another video, possibly. I'm not sure. It's going to be Friday or Monday. Check me out on YouTube. Subscribe to me. Leave me questions. I'll answer them on the blog live. Thank you for tuning in.